Hi guys, welcome to Biyahe ni Bu. This is Bu Larocco of Biyahe ni Bu. And before we start, I just want to let you know that this is the first time that I'm gonna make a video in English or Taglish. That's Tagalog plus English in one. <laughs> okay, this is to reach out to our brothers and sisters around the world. <laughs> Uh, so please bear with me because my English is not that good, but I will do my best. But I guess my best wasn't good enough. <laughs> <laughs> okay, also to let you know, just you might hear some noises because we don't have a quiet room. So please bear with me again. <laughs> okay, so today we're gonna look at the Boss ME90. And recently, Boss is promoting its... AIRD amp simulation okay so according to boss AIRD is augmented impulse response dynamics according to them this is a technology realizes bosses acclaimed tube logic concept in a digital guitar processor okay so let's see how true that is also, we're going to be using my two favorite Celestion IRs, one for clean and one for high gain amps. And let's compare it to the default speaker simulation of the boss. Okay, so let's start this and we're going to start it with the natural, the first option. I think it's a clean sounding amp. my favorite Celestion IR. I like this better, the Celestion IR, because it got some low frequencies. Okay, so that's the natural. Now we go to the second option, which is, which is the X Crunch. default speaker as you can hear there are some frequencies that I think you need to cut with the speaker simulation of the boss that's X scratch Let's add some delay, analog delay. switch to the X high gain and change my IR to the, to the Celestion IR for high gain heavy mix Add some delay. Oh, 
Okay, so far for the clean amps, I'm really liking the clean or low gain amps. But for the high gain amps, I don't know. I'm not going to pretend that I'm great with high gain amps. I usually use single coils on low gain amps and boost it with pedals if I need more gain. But for me, this high gain amp is not that bad, and, but not that great either. But usable for me, I think it's still good enough if you need some high gain sounds. Let's check out the other amp models. The maximum. So this is a vintage Marshall amp model. I like this one. <laughs> Juggernaut. I think you're gonna need a humbucker pickup for this one <laughs> because we're using a strat. X modded. I like this one too. Twin combo, it's clean again, so let's change the IR to the Celestron IR for clean. <laughs> bright Fender Twin Reverb Let's try the default speaker I, I really don't like the high high mid frequencies coming out from the default one. So let's change it to the Celestion again. Okay, so that's Fender Twin. I think it's bright sounding. This is Tweed Combo. Fender Bassman. Let's add some overdrive. Okay, so that's the two Fender models. For me, I'm not really digging it. <laughs> the two Fender models. This is Diamond. It's AC30. Box AC thirteen. Let's add some OD. I 
like is better than the Fender. Okay, so Brit Stack Marshall 1959. Change the IR again to the high gain. I think this one is realistic it's very martial sounding but lately I, I'm not into martial amps <laughs> now we're down to the last option as you can see in the tone studio it says selectable here this is what it means you have more options to choose from here as you can see you can only change this in the tone studio by a computer or phone I hope Boss releases an update where you can change this in the in the unit itself. But yes, still a great addition. So let's hear how this amp sound. Let's try the first one, direct T stack. I think this is something Mesa. Mesa boogie. This will sound better if you are using humbucker. Second one is transparent. I think in this amp, you can really hear the sound of your guitar pickup let's add some delay and an od Add some chorus. Reverb. That's transparent and this one is boutique. Supreme. This one needs some bar <laughs> as well. Let's change the IR. JC120. Last one is the deluxe combo. I 
I like this better than the previous Fender models. <laughs> it's really nice. Okay, so that's the Boss AI RD apps. For me, it's a great improvement compared to the previous Boss Cos M amp simulations. And I would definitely recommend the Boss ME90 and its latest units with AI RD amps if you really need a good amp modeler with a reasonable price. So let me know what you think at the comment section guys and please like, share, subscribe. Once again, this is Boo of Bihaini Boo. Thanks for watching and see you. Bye guys.